Hey rodeo fans, yeah, I'm out here at Cowboy Christmas for the NFR and I am here at the community coffee stand. You've seen some of this coffee at the rodeos that I work. You've seen the coffee volunteers get to have some of this coffee. It is some good coffee that we have. And right here we have John Jackson that's part of the community coffee. John, how has your day been today? It's been busy. Saturdays, you know, the Saturday before and the Saturday, the last Saturday are probably the busiest two days here. So it was a slow start, but we now have wall-to-wall -wall people, and we have them pretty tired here in Vegas, so we're selling them a lot of coffee. As my fans know that this is probably my favorite booth out of all of the booths in the rodeo is because I get free coffee. You guys know I love my coffee, so I've definitely tested out almost every type here. Um, John, what can you tell us about the, com the coffee that's put on here? So right this year, we are actually bringing in our Christmas blend, which are medium roast, but we also have our high octane, which is our dark and bold. We call that cowboy fuel if needed for those early morning starts, a little bit more uh, intense, bold blend. Not it's not based off the caffeine side. However, if you go to the espresso side, then the caffeine comes up a little bit and the kick gets a little bit better. But as we've seen over the years that cowboys and cowgirls like a good medium roast coffee, and, and that's my favorite coffee too. I definitely love the dark bold. Uh, that's what the coffee that I have samples at for the PRCA contestants and the members, and it goes by pretty quick not just because of myself, but because of all the rodeo contestants. Let's talk about a little bit about the family, the, that, the workers behind the scenes of this coffee. Right. So believe it or not, this family has a very long valued history. We are a 105 year old company. We are the largest family owned coffee business in America today. And to this day, uh, there is now one, two, three, four, five, six of the generations still work at Community Coffee and meet twice a week to taste every cup of coffee and every shipment of beans that we get from Origin each, each and every week, bar none. Those two, fam two family members will taste some of this coffee as we call it cupping and approve the orders coming in overseas. So if, if they taste an anomaly that's not supposed to be there and they'll come back the next day and try that same thing again, if there's two people that agree that this is not a good uh, shipment for us, $4 million worth of beans goes right back to origin. So that's how peculiar these family members are and we only source premium beans. We don't do the other brands where we just get cheap beans. We source, we have 30 year old contracts with Origins and we have specific farms to which we only source premium coffee beans. So what you're getting is the best of the best. That is amazing. I'm glad that this test taste goes through two people. I think that's a job that I could do very well at testing. Now there's seven at the table, coffee. so you're going to have to elbow in with one of seven, <laughs> but there's always two family members at the table. They so have I'm, the most experience. One's 83 years old, Miss Donna, who is the current sitting president, board uh, president of Community Coffee, and then her son Hank and her son Matt, and then sometimes their their kids will come in and they're starting to learn the business and, and all the scopes, and they have to learn it from the ground up. Most of them started sweeping the floors in the warehouse, believe it or not. That is just great to know. Uh, a lot of people don't know how their coffee is actually produced and getting put out on the shelves. It's good to know that you guys take quality and you guys make sure that that quality is there before it comes out to us customers. Well, John, I won't busy your day up anymore. We'll see you at the NFR, folks. We are on round two for the NFR. It was a tough night last night. Tonight's going to be even funner as the atmosphere is growing. It's getting loud. It's getting energetic. And you know the contestants are going to put out what they can. Thank you, John. We'll Thank see you, you there. Appreciate it. No, it's, I, it's a... Easy enough. <laughs>